next exercise we're going to look at, James, is a front raise. So it's an isolation exercise for the deltoids, and it's going to work the anterior, the front head. So from here, dumbbell variation. Now, James, your elbow joint is a hinge joint. So if it's a really heavy weight and I'm holding it like that, the weight's going through that hinge joint and it doesn't really like it because it wants to move in that direction and that direction. So I'm actually going to turn my palms in for this just so that it helps me for if anything goes wrong. Same points of contact with the bench, shoulder blades, head and bottom from here. your barbell variation. It's always hard when you're doing it seated, but it works really well when they're standing up. From here, while they're getting used to the movement, if they're a little bit unsafe or uneasy with two dumbbells or individual dumbbells, try them on a barbell. So the only thing is, James, hard to adopt that position we spoke about in the elbow. So from here, Same exercise in a standard version. Okay. James, can I see the dumbbell variation, please? See the, yes, please, if you can. So, like we say, isolation exercise, which means only one joint is moving, it's going to be that shoulder joint. Just put your feet a little bit further forward for me, do you And then try breathing in as you lift up. And that's only going to help you because your chest is going to expand as you breathe in. Wonderful technique. You blow out as you go down. So we're working this area of the deltoid at the front. And what looks really good from a side angle, James, is you'll notice that your ears are lying with your shoulder and with your hip. So you're neutral throughout. Well done, and just one more. Lovely stuff. I'm taking a little rest there. Hinge from the hips as you place your weight down to the floor. Okay, I'm going to pass you the barbell just so we can get an idea of what the exercise looks like with the barbell. Okay. Here, I'm going to place my hands inside your hands. I'm going to keep the weight close to your thighs. You've got that weight, James? Good man, there you go. Nice soft elbows. Head back onto contact with the bench. And breathe in as you lift that bar up into the air, pausing at shoulder height. Wonderful technique, blow it out as you come down. Two more, please, James. Lovely technique. You can see that your core is drawn in throughout. Fantastic. Weight down to the thighs. Now, if I was going to pick this weight up from you, I'm going to get myself into a strong position. Quite close to you, a little bit intimate, I know. James, I've got that weight. Okay, it's my way to separate. 